Not if I catch it first, motherfucker. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. Okay. Huh? I just want to comment that Doker's Doker would be the worst person to be like because not only would you attack people, but yeah, you would attack people. That's why you're literally alone because you attack everyone. Yeah. Oh, um, right. Picture. We're supposed to take a picture. So you can take the next one too, if you if you don't mind, Aaron Bright. What the fuck poses that? Hey, your character did it too, not just him. Yeah, I know. Phew, I knew it was the right call to let you handle it, Aaron Bright. Now onto the next signboard. Oh, and you know the mountain the story say the ogre lives on? It's actually Oni Mountain. You can climb it from the stairs over there. If you want it, we can go... We could go see the ogre's home. Folks call it the dreaded den. Sure, I want to see it. Oh, Dix is gone. Yes, I really wanted you to see it for yourself, Aaron Brett. So, if you keep climbing up... You'll reach the Infernal Pass. There's a sign before that. If you turn at, at the sign, you can get to, in, to the dreaded den. So, 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 I'll just head on out then. Come on down when you're ready, and be careful. You know what? As much as I don't want to, I'm gonna bring back False Swipe. For Lemon. <laughs> I'm so happy that they let you do this. Like, instead of going to a person and paying, you can just remember moves yourself. Well, it's kind of weird you couldn't before. Yeah. I already got it. I already got that. Do I have a growler? Yes. Ooh, I don't have a more Pekka. A Pika the Galar Pikachu clone. Oh my gosh, look at what Lem it looks like Lemon's doing. It looks like it's staring down its dinner. I don't think that's really a Pikachu clone, it's literally a hamster. Well, they happen in every game, so it's, it's put in the category of Pikachu clone. Plus, I think it actually is a mouse. It's a hamster. Oh, it is. Well, then again, Pachirisu is a squirrel, but it's a Pikachu clone. I will admit they give the rodents too many Pikachu traits. Yeah. It would be nice if they were less Pikachu-like. Yeah. Yeah, because the face right here looks like Pikachu. More Pekka, a two-sided Pokemon. It has a small stomach. If it isn't constantly eating the seeds it keeps in its pockets, it'll get hungry immediately. You could name it Hangry. Nah. <laughs> I'm not gonna name it. It's gonna be set in the box for all eternity. I don't wanna name that. This over here. Yeah. 
I do not have you. Get over here, motherfucker. Are you just wearing out whatever the hell that is? Yes. Now stay in the ball, bitch. Wait, is it named Timber? Yeah. You never noticed? my first time seeing it, so... Oh, okay. Timber, the muscular Pokémon. It fights by swinging a piece of lumber around. It is close to evolving when it can handle heavy lumber... Uh, wait, hold on. Did I get cut off? No. Oh. <laughs> It is close to evolving where it can handle heavy lumber without difficulty. Wrong. Um, wait, is that Bonsley? Oh, I already called Bonsley, never mind. Any new Pokemon that I wouldn't mind shoving forever inside my Pokemon box? Is that a sound? I already caught that, so that means I already had the, the evolution. Thank fuck. Just getting a female Salander is a pain in the ass. From 1 to 10, how pain in the ass is it? It's a 1% encounter rate for a female. And only females can evolve. Oh! I remember females only evolve, but that's... I guess she has a big harem. <laughs> You're actually not wrong, that actually is stated in a Pokedex. <laughs> well, that happens with Pokemon? Nothing. That happens with animals sometimes, so it's not surprising they do with Pokemon Bowl. And I got a Geodude. Oh shit. What? In order to evolve the final evolution of Geodude, I need to trade. Well, shit. <laughs> Geodude, the rock Pokemon. Most people may not notice, but a closer look should reveal that there are many Geodude around. Unless I already have a golem. I do not have a golem. God damn it. Look, it's Magikarp in the water. What the fuck is that? I thought it's a Barracuda. I already have that. Wait, why is that... Oh, is that a... Can you swim? Uh, with one of my Pokemon I can, yeah. But, uh... All the Pokemon in there I already have. Oh, I was looking at the sparkly. You really don't go after sparkly items, do you? It's usually just berries and stuff. It's not really all that worth getting. Yeah, it just ripped one Pokeball. Man, I guess I'm the sort that goes after anything and everything, and you're just like, eh. Then again, you're probably better at playing this than I am. Yeah. <laughs> I wish we could have gotten that Roblox game to work where we can both play Pokemon together. Well, wait, wasn't the only one who couldn't get Roblox to work was, uh, Hatchet? I can't remember. I can't tell what that is down there. Oh, that's a Ripper. I already have a Ripper. <laughs> Definitely means I can look around. A lot easier. 
I'm hoping that I can find a golem in the wild. I don't have anyone I can trade with anymore. And we already know why, so we don't need to bring it up. <laughs> yeah. I also find it annoying that in order to evolve some Pokemon you have to trade it. Because the person you trade it to can just keep it and never give it back to you. Yeah. It literally is like saying, in order to play Pokemon and enjoy it, you need friends. <laughs> Sucks for most people <laughs> who are gamers. Yeah. That means the only way to get all the Pokemon would be through random trading. Yeah, there's actually a thing that's going on with the trading. Um, if you get a Pokemon with a, uh, with the name of a website or whatever as its name, um, those are hacked Pokemon. Oh! Are you, how do you, are you, how do you, uh, report that? I don't think you do. You just delete the Pokemon. <laughs> uh, okay. What happens if you just trade it? It comes someone else's problem. Well, then maybe do that. <laughs> Feels like they're not doing enough to make it, uh, really mean anything to not pass the problem to someone else. I don't want to sound mean, but... Yeah, if I remember correctly, I should be able to evolve Clefairy. Clefairy turns into Clefable, you use the Moonstone. Yep, I just picked one up, so yeah. <laughs> Clefairy. The fairy Pokemon. On nights with a full moon, they gather together and dance. The surrounding area is enveloped in an abnormal magnetic field. Clefairy is both the original fairy Pokemon and the original alien Pokemon. It's from the fucking moon. I don't know where it would be placed. Maybe in here? Ah, oh, there we go. Moonstone. It's an item. Oh. I gotta take them out of the box first. I was hoping I didn't have to, but I guess I have to. <laughs> What were you expecting? Well, in Scarlet and Violet, you didn't have to. Oh, not, not Scarlet and Violet. In Sword and Shield, goddammit. Well, this is not Sword and Shield. Wait, did you just vanish? Yes. <laughs> Clefable, the fairy Pokemon. It has an acute sense of hearing. It can easily hear a pen being dropped nearly 1,100 yards away. That also means that the baby version of Clefable is somewhere. Premier Ball. 
What does a premiere fall even do? Something, uh... I mean, it's, it's... It's no better than a regular Pokeball, to be honest. Oh! Shit, I've got to check to see if I already caught it or not. Yes, I did. God damn it, I forgot to hit the button. Oh my gosh, it's Hatch's favorite Pokemon over here. Coughing. <laughs> yeah. he, they, he, they actually hate this because they kept showing up repeatedly. And I think Pokemon Infinite Fusion. Well, I'm very glad I didn't send my map straight shot back. I'll just send it to you. See something different? Different? Oh. <laughs> Coughing. The poison gas Pokemon. The poisonous gases it contains are a little bit lighter than air. That's why it's always slightly airborne. Oh, I see a chain ring. Come here, bitch. <laughs> it just got an RRR at you. Yes, it did an RRR. <laughs> Jingling, the bell Pokemon. It emits high frequency cries that people can't hear. Once it starts, it can cry for an awfully long time. Oh, wow, this is getting easy to fill out this Pokedex. I already have a mini queue. I think out of all Pikachu clones, I think Mimikyu is most well liked. Yes, I found it. And technically, out of all the Pikachu clones, Mimikyu is my favorite. God damn it. Well, Mimikyu isn't actually a Pikachu clone, it's not a rodent. Yeah. It's literally a curse that uses a cute blanket to cover itself, so you don't die. And people love it more than all the goddamn- Yeah. Like, if you look at me, you die! Hee <laughs> hee! Everyone's like, oh my god, you're so cute! <laughs> it just wants love! Which is fair, it does, but... You know, they forget about the whole if you see it, that you die part. Oh my gosh, there's a group of Houndor. Are they? Why are they? They're surrounding a pig, so I think they're gonna go kill it. <laughs> that doesn't happen in Pokemon. Well, I mean, Pokemon do hunt and eat other Pokemon. <laughs> it is... Well, yeah, I'm just saying they never show that in the actual game. Yeah. Pokemon. Rated R edition. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> do I have a hound? Yes. I'm just checking every everyone around here. Buster, why did you jump off the bed? Oh, I got two quick balls. I got reimbursed. <laughs> Also going up here not even knowing if this is actually the right way to fucking go. It probably isn't, but I'm going here anyway. 
I think the best way to go up for now is get up. <laughs> I just ran Slugma over. <laughs> Slugma, the lava Pokemon. It's said that in ancient times when volcanoes were more active, there were many more Slugma than there are now. I feel like that's kind of a given. Like, oh, this thing that lives in lava, when there was more lava, there was more Slugma. You don't say. <laughs> Told that I'm not allowed to go this way. What? I mean, like, usually it would say something like, hey, you should go back and go this direction. <gasps> Litwick! You're going to catch the ghost fire, baby? Yes, where its evolution stands outside of hospitals. <laughs> Right! I'm not wrong! <laughs> right! Litwick, the candle Pokemon. While shining a light and pretending to be a guide, it leashes off the life force of any who follow it. We didn't even touch. How the fuck do you react to it? You drove right into it. I mean, it looks like I'm right next to it. No. Alright. Uh, let's go up here. Yes, I knew someone would be up here. Gyro Ball. That's actually not a bad move. Special Pokemon over there. Anything in the water? Just, just Magic Carp. That's great. That's great. Nintendo. Thanks. I'll be right back. I really need to take a pin. Okay. Ooh, Lampant. Let me use false swipe again. God damn it. Alright, let's heal you, Lemon. 
Don't worry, Lemon. I'll heal you. I love you, Lemon. You're the... the hero. Picture of this. Lampant, the lamp Pokemon. The spirits it absorbs fuels. Oh wait, hold on. The spirits it absorbs fuel its ba baleful fire. It hangs around hospitals waiting for people to pass on. Take a max revive. That's very useful. It's not the only max revive you've found. Yeah. Oh, Jiri, I need to tell you something. I caught the what? Lampant. Here's what his Pokedex entry said. Lampant, the Lamp Pokemon. The spirits it absorbs fuels its ba baleful fire. It hangs around hospitals waiting for people to pass on. <laughs> Guess now we go towards that gate thing. I saw where was it? Ah, there it is. Hold on, there actually is a way to tell if I'm going the right way. Am I? Okay, so if we go up this way. That looks like towards the crystal pool. And I was supposed to go here. But I'm guessing I can go through here, then climb up and get there. I mean, it's not like I don't have a Pokemon I can climb. <laughs> Oh, that is actually really pretty. That is so pretty. I got hit by something. God damn it, Aracuda. A fish. You got hit by a fish. That you have. Yeah, I don't need you. Fuck off. <laughs> the fish is like, I want to, and you're like, no, thank you. God damn it, Yanma. I was trying to look in the water, bitch. Oh, there's a special Pokemon over there. That orange glow thing. Uh, it may be an evolution for something I need. What the it might be. What is Glimit doing here? You're supposed to be in Area Zero. 
Well, now apparently it's also in France. Yeah. <laughs> it vanished off into France. Whoa, what the fuck? Okay, I already have a bronze sword. I couldn't tell what it was for a second. That was a brand new Pokemon or something. Oh, it's just not a Pokemon I need, so I'm not going after it. Oh, are you sure you won't fight it? It has a special blow. Yes. Fuck you, Bronzor. <laughs> no, I just one-shot it. Nah, it's not worth Lemon's time. There's a female here? Oh, and there's also that bitch which I need. So I need to look more thoroughly because. Alright, there are two Pokemon here that I believe I need. And it's probably in the water. Well, I know Feebas has to be in the water, but where? I don't see that bitch. That's Aracuda. Bitch, where the fuck are you? It's that Pokedex that says you're here. I'm CO ass. There might be a lone counter right for the end uh, for that fee bass. I'm probably increase it by doing the, the, the thing for water type of one sandwich. I'll probably do it after I go to the den. I'll come back up here. So I know where it's at. I'll be back, but I'm really, really hungry. Okay. Go eat. I've already eaten today. It's just, for some reason, my stomach is yelling at me. Ah. Uh. I know your stomach cannot yell or not yell at you, but mine yells. Okay, I'm just superhuman. I don't need to eat, I just eat when I can. Right! Your body needs food! You just can't tell when you're full! Ah, here we go, finally! Not being able to tell when you're full is not a superpower! <laughs> Where is it? No! <laughs> You're right. Did you have trouble getting across that narrow path? Th there it is, the dreaded den. This is supposed to be the ogre's home. At least that's what everybody says. I, I came here out of time, but I've never seen it. 
Give me a powerful ogre like that would only show up if it heard some kind of battle going on. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. I think I got a bit stronger since last time we battled, so, you know. Since the last time we battled, uh, it's, uh, so, you know, if you wanted to, we could battle. Yeah, let's do it. Alright, though, uh, we should heal up our teams first. Okay. I'll give it all, all I got. I, I, I got this. I'm gonna whoop your ass. I like you, but I'm gonna whoop your ass. Now you evolved your Pokemon. Wise. But still, you're gonna lose. <laughs> that was just one attack on me, and I did so much. I did so much damage. Oh shit! And my switch, Grand Inferno. <laughs> well, I haven't used Brown Gas in a long time. I just realized that. Giga Drain. <laughs> Thank you, Bramble Gas. I knew you could do it. Poor kid. Ah, man, I lost. I knew it. You're really strong, Aaron Brad. How am I ever going to be able to beat you? If the Oka saw that battle, I'm sure he'd be thinking, that kid's got real strength. See, my school, Blueberry Academy. It's a school that specializes in teaching the art of Pokemon battling. If I were as strong as you, maybe I could aim to be the best trainer there. Let's go have a look at that, at the Oka's den. Oh shit, well, they were watching. Watch your head. See how dark it is in here? And cramped? Even the floor's all rough and uneven. Living all alone in a place like this would get pretty miserable, don't you think? Poor ogre. We have plenty of room in our house. I would have totally let it stay with us. Sweet kid, Karen. No, no, I'm not. I've just always liked the stories about the ogre, that's all. But... but if the ogre really did show up to stay at our place, I'm sure the whole town would freak.
Well, no way, the sun's already gone down. Guess we'll have to save the last signboard for tomorrow. Oh, I almost forgot. Today's the first day of the Festival of Masks over at Kitakami Hall. So this big event where everyone puts on masks and runs around celebrating. I mean, it's not like you gotta go or anything, but if you wanted to, you know, check it out. Well, it'd be fun. Go together. Y yeah why not? It'd be great to go together. There's just a few things we'd have to get ready for us, so we should swing by my house before heading to the festival. We live in the northeast corner of the village, so, um, let's see. I could maybe draw a map. Oh, your rotom phone has a map in it, huh? You want me to register it on your map? Yeah, I could give that a try. Asses! It sure is handy having a map that shows up you everything right there in your phone. I'm gonna ask you to get a road time phone someday too. I'll be right behind you. If you wanna head to my family's place first, see you there. Was a path. Oh, I did not even notice the path. That would have been useful. But now instead of climbing and my way up here, that's just a special geo dude. Who doesn't like having the ability to fly into the air? Well, it's more of fly than flying, but still. God damn it, Ekans! I thought I saw a Pokemon I don't have! Fuck off! Yep, I was right, I don't have this. And boom, which is <laughs> Volby, the Firefly Pokemon. It flashes the light on its rear to communicate with other Volby. It loves the sweet aroma given off by Lumise. Blue is probably a version of Smoosa. That's just great. Class is blind.
here. And boom. Too easy. Grandpa, I'm home. Welcome, young Kieran. And who's this with you? Oh, um, this is Erin Bright. She's part of the same school trip as me and Sis. Oh, ho. so this is the new friends of your friend of yours, eh, Kieran? Sure am. Wait, what? We, really? We're, we're, we're friends? We're friends. Feel all tingling funny hearing <laughs> that. Thank you for befriending our Karen and Bright. Oh, jeez. Thank you for the follow. Uh, uh, Beck Luco. I appreciate it. Thank you. Oh, oh, Karen made a... Karen's made a friend. Yeah, this is Aaron Bright. Aaron Bright, this is my grandma. Well, fancy that. My f a friend of Ken's was delighted to have you, Aaron Brett. Oh my, is it already s sundown? Goodness me, I nearly forgotten. The festival of mass starts tonight, doesn't it? Come now, Kieran. You too, Aaron Brett. I'll get out some Jinbei for you both so you can go to the festival all ga gussied it up. Hear that? We get to dress up in Jinbei. Yay! Now, now, don't go running out of just yet. We have to do your hair too. There we are. All done. Suits you mighty fine, just as I thought it would. Goodness, it's like I've gained another granddaughter. <laughs> Imagine a stylist doing a thing like yourself can make you good use of this too, Aaron Brat. And the teal style car. Having one of these cars increases the selection available you to you in boutiques and hair salons. Ooh, cool. And that kind should open up all sorts of new things, uh, new looks for you at the big city shops and salons. Hey, Grand, do you know what my. Yeah, what are you doing here? Ambed said she'd go to the Festival of Mass with me. Oh, really? Is that so? What's it matter anyway? What are you doing back here? Oh right, Grand. I couldn't find my mask for the festival. Oh, the ma mask? They should be in the shed. I put them there after last year's festival. It should be locked so you three can go have a rummage and see what you find. Uh, Alright. To the shed, first one there wins. Wait, sis, you're such a cheetah. Please forgive these, please forgive these two, Aaron Bright. They can be a bit rambunctious. Move, okay, there we go. There's got to be another one. Sis, Aaron Bright's here. Just rolling up like you own the place. Well, it looks like the only there's only two masks in the shed. Too bad, right? There's nothing I can do about it. 
guess you'll just have to do without a mask, eh? First come, first served, and all that. That's fun. Come on now. Don't look so glum. How about instead of a mask, I give you a battle in style. Festival style. Come on. Get in position. Survived on one. Despite the mask, come on, stop with the super effective moves. Come on, fuck you. Oh no. Oh uh, yeah, I have to the slash. Just use stop. Yeah, you didn't do much. Bitch. <laughs> Go, Green Inferno. What? What are you gonna do? Shadow Ball? That, that, that's not really all that special. And it didn't do a massive amount of damage like I did to you. So. And there goes your another Pokemon. They're totally doing so great. It's totally not like I'm whooping your ass. <laughs> that worked. <laughs> I'm more powerful than you are, bitch. Swamp Moon. Uh, Grand Inferno. Because that's a bug. Man, this is easy. This is an easy fight. Crushing wood, that's what feeling like a win. Yeah, right. I highly doubt your bug is gonna take out my team. I'm gonna lose. Accept it. Bitch. Huh? Oh, hi, Jerry. <laughs> No, I was talking to this bitch. Oh. <laughs> You're okay. supposed to be in part of distracted. Maybe. What? Hey, you're supposed to be enamored and distracted by my festival style. 
I'm not. Fuck you. <laughs> oh well. It's not like being me was gonna cause another mess to magically appear. Wait, now, did a magic mask appear? No. Oh. Now then, let me get my mask. Oh, you don't have one. Yeah. How's that? Look good, don't I? No. It's okay, Aaron, right? You can just wear my mask. What? No. I already said it's first come, first serve. And besides, that's your ogre mask. You always love that mask, love that mask best. Yeah, but... No buts about it. Erin Bright can just get her own mask at the festival. She's fine. Now, move it. Let's go. Bitch. Ugh. Sorry, Erin Bright. Erin Bright. I know my sister's kinda harsh, but she's really not all that bad. I don't care. Fuck her. <laughs> Actually, she was tearing the shred apart trying to find a third mask for you before you got there. Uh oh, but uh, don't tell her I told you that, Aaron Brett. I honestly don't think people like that are charming. Because in the real world, people like that are the ones that are likely to kill themselves and take someone with them. Yeah. The festival of masks is to head up at Kitagami Hall. We should probably get going. I can just ride my ride on over there to see if any Pokemon come out at night. Bookworm! Hey, how's it hanging? Oh my, this is the original variant. Hey, Book. Well, why are you trying to go through the, the ride patties? There's an Illumise over here, and I need it for the Pokédex. Oh. Where the fuck you that? There's nothing here. Did it just vanish? No, it's saying it's here, but it's not. I'm sorry. Show yourself. I need you. Bookworm, make it appear. That's not the right one. That's the right one. I'm just finished up work. Uh, <laughs> it's not a Lumise. That's the other one. Fireflies for you all. <laughs> Fuck you, book. You'll find it. Maybe not right now, but you can go back later. Well, I'm, I'm gonna search for it. I wish you could just like run around in the grass and then like a battle scene will cut in. But this is don't. not the grass. It's literally rice field. Well, you know what I mean. Like in the old games, you can just run around and like, here. Oh, you can't do that here. 